the ruins of the palace of King Rajasinghe the first has been discovered during excavations that took place in the premises of the Sitawaka fortress. Assistant Director of Archaeology for the Sabaragama province, Thissamadara Pirama said that the ruins of a stairwell of the palace has been discovered. The second phase of excavations are currently taking place in the site believed to be the palace of King Sitawaka Rajasinghe and a Dutch era fort located in Bandarawatta Sitawaka. The excavations are supervised by the Assistant Director of Archaeology for the Sabaragamu Province. The excavation project is headed by the Assistant Director for Archaeology for the Sabaragamu Province, HSTK Madura Pirma. <laughs> We are at an important juncture of the Sitawaka Kingdom. We are at the location believed to be where the palace once stood. Special excavations were not conducted here before. Therefore, excavations commenced last year in this area. This area was also under the Dutch as a fortress after they invaded the land. We identified the outer wall and four bastions. After the excavations in the outer area, we commenced the excavations in the inner area of the site. We discovered certain artifacts carved out of black stones. Therefore, we believe that we have found the ruins of an old stairwell that once belonged to the palace. We have discovered very important features. We believe that further excavations will help in proving that this was where the palace of King Rajasinghe from the Sitawaka era once stood. History records that Prince Tikri Bandara, also known as Prince Rajasinghe, claimed the throne after murdering his father, King Maya Dunne. King Maya Dunne was one of the three brothers involved in the famous Vijayabha Kolaya. King Rajasinghe's reign on the throne was from 1581 to 1593 and he also led the war against the Portuguese. He was famous for the Portuguese massacre in the battle in Muleria.